Lisa. I should have listened to this speech before. <laughs> As I was trying to study to do the evaluation, I was my mind was going blind because I wanted to take notes. It was so great, but I also I remember that I have to evaluate. <laughs> so I was like, what do I do now? But I just want to say that today I learned from Irma a very interesting way of doing speech evaluation, and this is by using an acronym. So I consider that evaluation is saying uh, it's like a synonym to check. So I'm good use it. Sorry, I'm going to use the word check for this evaluation. So the first word in check is consistent. So I was looking for consistency in your speech. And you started and you engage the, uh, the audience by asking a question, please draw the attention like right away. And you, you told us the purpose of your speech, how to evaluate. It flew very nicely the entire speech by giving advices and you also uh, close the speech with uh, mentioning again the purpose of the evaluation. The next uh, letter is H on homework. I find that you have done your homework. You brought jobs like sunglasses and eyeglasses and the paper, and you put very much uh, thought into helping us and remembering things that we can, it can help us in the evaluation. The next letter is E from educate and encourage. You educated us, you gave us very good hints like what to look for in a speech, and it was very educative. The next is C, call from act, calls to action. Again, you use the props, you, you gave us things to look for in speech, you also told us how to fold the paper and to what to look in every quadrant, what to what notes to take for. I promise I will do it next time. Now it's blank. <laughs> <laughs> and last letter is K from I I I was thinking of knowledge. You have so much knowledge to share with us. It's much appreciated. I learned to evaluate from one of the best in the club, and I'm so proud to learn from you. I'm just a novice of this, but you were the protagonist of the speech session. You have very good energy. You have very good hand gestures. You moved around. You look at us. You ask questions, and you gave us very good things, and I'm so happy to learn from you. Thank you so much.